Hey everybody, I'm here today to talk to you about a laptop trackpad that is not clicking sometimes or not clicking at all, all the time. I'll be showing you the ways that you can fix it in one quick minute in this simplistic tutorial with a few simple steps. Let's get right into this video. So if your laptop trackpad like this is not clicking, it can be one of two problems or it can actually be two problems as well. So essentially it can be either the software which is on the computer or the hardware which is the actual trackpad or it can be a combination of both. Now most of the time, if you didn't change any settings on your computer, it's just gonna be the hardware. And because it's a laptop, you know, you might be eating around it or drinking or you're bringing it around with you, it's getting dusty in your laptop bag. So most likely it's gonna be the hardware which is the actual trackpad itself. There are three easy things that you can do and all three of these things will literally take you less than a minute and they will most likely fix your problem. This happens to me all the time because I use my laptop constantly. Um, this is actually uh, the laptop that my kids use right now. It's a Chromebook and uh, you know, they're always like, like they don't eat around it. We have some pretty strict rules about no food or drink around the laptop, but at the end of the day, their kids, their young kids, their fingers are sticky. So I have to clean this trackpad all the time. So let's get into these three simple steps. The first thing that you can do is actually blow intensely with your breath around the perimeter of the trackpad. So literally just get your breath and just like blow as intensely as you can a few times around the perimeter of the trackpad. Alternatively, if you have a can of compressed air, you can just blow that compressed air around the trackpad as well. Um, and that will get rid of any dust or dirt or debris that is caught around the outside edges for the most part, okay? But then you also want to go with the second step which is the second step is to get a small toothpick and just use the toothpick to gently go around the perimeter of the trackpad. Now, I used to recommend from time to time using a little like needle, like a sewing needle, but then if you're not careful, you can end up damaging the trackpad or scratching it. But a toothpick is just a little wooden toothpick. It's not gonna really cause any damage. Just go slowly and gently around the outside edges and that ensures that anything that is still caught along the edges that you haven't been able to get out using your compressed air or using your intense breath, uh, breath blowing, will now be loosened up. And then the third thing that you can do is get a cloth that is barely damp. And I mean, not, not one that's wet or damp. I mean barely damp, as in like, get a drop of water on the corner of a cloth and wring it out. Like literally a drop of water on the corner of a cloth and wring it out. And then use that cloth to go around the outside edges, the perimeter of the trackpad as well. And that will essentially sort of remove any gunk or any sticky thing that was sort of caught along the edges. It will sort of melt down any, any uh, crumbs that you haven't been able to remove or any dirt that you haven't been able to remove it'll sort of uh, loosen it up okay and if you do those three things they will most likely work and they will most likely fix a trackpad issue like i said i've used these three methods many times and it always works it always fixes the problem so hopefully it works for you as well if you like this video tutorial please be sure to give it a thumbs up let me know what you think down below as a comment and of course be sure to subscribe for more great videos just like this one and that's all i have for you today thanks for watching